If you're new here, I'm Jody, and we're here at another state park. Sibley. Sibley State Park. And we have an expert because I've never been to Sibley State Park before. Janie's been here a lot of times. But Grandpa, how long have you been coming to Sibley State Park? Ages. <laughs> Ages. Since I was a little kid. So basically since the park existed. <laughs> the dinosaur ages, Grandpa. Yes, that's right, the dinosaurs. We had to watch out for them. I think online it said this park was established in 1919, like the root beer. For this video, we asked Grandpa if he would be our tour guide and he decided to bring us to his favorite place in the park. What's the secret to Sibley State Park? What's the secret? Yeah. It's just, just a beautiful place to go and to enjoy yourself. Raspberry bush. They're not quite ready yet though. Oh yeah. I love raspberries, especially fresh raspberries. Grandpa also brought a secret tool to experience the state park with. Yes. What's this called? The eyeball. The eyeball. You're almost there Grandpa, can you do it? Are you sure you I can help you if you want me to. No, I haven't got a side to. Oh, you're right. Where are we right now? So we're right outside of like New London, Spicer. We're that way. Okay. This is Mount Tom. No elevator, sorry Grandpa. But you made it all the way up here. Look. Over that way is... is uh, what lake am I looking at? Lake Andrew? Yeah. Over there? Where that store is. Oh, okay. What water tower am I looking at? That's gotta be New London. This would be gorgeous in the fall. Yep, with all the changing leaves. So online, when I looked at reviews for the state park, it said that the Oak Ridge campsites are better than the Lakeview campsites, because you have more privacy. They also said that the fall colors are beautiful. You know, something that's really interesting what? that you can look up at some point too is like who this is named after. Sibley, was well known for his partnerships that he had with like Native Americans in the area. When we look back in history, oftentimes we see like at the time we saw things like in one way and now we look at them very much in another way and looking at the other side of Sibley, like a lot of his partnerships benefited him more than they benefited um, Native Americans, which happened quite often too. Checking out the eyeball. Yeah, it's a nice eyeball. Grandpa, she likes your eyeball. It's a nice eyeball, Grandpa. It's pretty. How peaceful it is here. It's very peaceful. So technically, this isn't my grandpa, but I follow the philosophy. Your grandpa is my grandpa, my grandpa is our grandpa, so that's my grandpa and that's your grandpa. Right, grandpa? Right. Yeah, it said that's New London, Grandpa. And that over there is Spicer. Yeah. Typically when I go to a state park, I try to see and do and experience as many things as possible. But this trip was special because I slowed down, hung out with Grandpa, and I got to see his perspective on the park. That's a pretty mm -hmm. flower. Kind of. Mm. This is the one. You should take this picture of that one. Which one? That flower? Wow. The thorns. Good one. Thorns. It's a nice flower. It's 
some good angles on it. So how has the state park changed since you were little? Well, we didn't come up this way. There was a path coming up over there. Okay, so this paved path this, wasn't here? No, this wasn't here. There was no parking lot. You, you couldn't drive up here. Was it uphill both ways too? It was. <laughs> How did you know? <laughs> but you know, I was, I suppose, fifth and sixth grade, seventh and eighth, ninth. You, you run, you, you want to be one of the first ones. Well, I couldn't run very fast, so I was. You weren't one of the first ones? I never was. That's okay. But you got the, to see the scenery more. Yeah, but the, 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 the paths were good. They were good ones? Yeah, and then you, you, after you got up here, you were here for a while. Then you headed back down and to go eat lunch. Okay. And then you either went. What'd you get for lunch? Uh, bologna sandwiches. Oh, I suppose there was some bars. My mother made cookies and bars. Ooh, yum. Mm. Isn't that beautiful? Mm hmm They're so pretty. What nature's made. Mm-hmm. Want him, Grandpa? No. You don't want him? No. Little chipmunks. You're almost there, Grandpa. There are miles of hiking trails. You can do short loops or you can do long loops. They have biking trails, camping. At the lake, they have kayaks that you can rent, canoes, here? yeah. Wow. Do you still have it? This yeah, is right. nice to be out here and nobody else is here. There's another one on the sign. There's another one down below. There's a lot of them down there, Grandpa. We are right no. here. How would you recommend somebody come and spend their day at this state park? On a cool day, unlike today, <laughs> it's, very it's hot. really hot. Um, but I would say just going around the trails and probably a picnic by the lake. That's what I would do. True. Or up on Mount Tom, that would be really cool to have yeah. a picnic up there. Yeah, I think you can do like a three-ish mile hike loop from probably down by the lake up to where we yep. just were. Up to Mount Tom, yep. And uh, picnic, mm -hmm. bring a swimsuit or not and just jump in the lake. Yep. Because it's hot. Maybe even make it a whole weekend and camp here. Yeah. Oh, it's nice. Yeah. Check for ticks. Always. Grandpa said there's wood ticks everywhere. Remember? There aren't really remember, mosquitoes yet. You remember what he told you about the animals? Oh. The, the hint, the secret that yeah, he told you? There's a secret about how to find the, find the animals that we learned from Grandpa. Are you going to say it? No, you can say it. You say it. They're in the woods. <laughs> <laughs> Top secret, don't tell anyone. <laughs> Which way we gotta go to get to the water, Grandpa? Oh, Joe, look. What? Deer. Where? Right back there. You see it? Oh, yeah, I do see it. Grandpa, there's a deer. Yeah, back up slowly. It's coming this way. There it goes, Grandpa, look. Yep. Right there. Female. See? They're in the woods. So, still sitting there. Cool Buck in little horns and his left front was just dangling. Oh no. Was it shot? It, it, it was dangling from the elbow. And he hopped and hopped, and we went up up there to tell them about it. They didn't come to the door. So I think they just they just you can't you can't help them. You can't put them down. Okay. You, you got to leave them, and then the coyotes get them. And other oh. animals. So it's it's all part of the solution. Let nature take care. It's just the natural way of it. Life. Beach and buoys for a swimming area. 
And uh, it looks like they have sand volleyball, a lot of sand. That's not too much for, sand. For the volleyball. Sand mountain ball. We probably shouldn't walk on this part. Oh yeah, it looks like they're doing Trying stuff. Trying to reseed. It doesn't look like you could even go inside. Online, one of the reviews also said that there were so many dogs here, and I am hearing some dog barking. How are the bathrooms? Pretty good. They even had like a, an electric or like a wave, like tape, paper towel dispenser. So wow, fancy, nice. very fancy. They've got a water fountain. Mm -hmm. This one, the ticket. You They're getting a ticket for not having a pass. But they don't have a sticker. Yeah, you gotta get your sticker, guys. Like that one. Yeah. Support the parks. Overall, one to ten, how would you rate Sibley Park? Twelve. Twelve? Yeah. It's a pretty good place. One to ten, how would you rate Sibley Park? Can I have chocolate on my face? <laughs> ten that, out of ten. Does that take points off? Chocolate on her face? A little free library right by the park office. the thing? Yeah. You want to see? Yes, sir. Yeah, I There's two right up there. Did you see the one down on the right? Two up there. And then one over here. Is, the, is it just a black? 